Thank you, Cooley administration, for, for this wonderful opportunity today. Congratulations, friends, colleagues. Can you believe it? Just a few short weeks ago, you took the last test that you will ever have to take. Sorry, what's that? Oh, I'm being told that there is one more test. I heard it's really easy. And at the end of the day, I, I know everybody will be ready for it. Uh, but it is a privilege to be here celebrating with all of you today. As I was getting ready to come here, uh, I couldn't help but notice a sign that sits above my kitchen sink. It was actually given to me by my mother uh, just as I started law school. It reads, when you get there, remember where you came from. When you get there, remember where you came from. How fitting a time like this. At some point, you made the decision, the commitment to embark on a challenging journey. Think back to the day when you got your acceptance letter, those first time buying books, to that first time meeting your professor. Fast forward to the end of your first year, where you were kind enough to spot all the legal issues for your family and friends, <laughs> whether they asked for it or not. There were even those that came to you for advice. Yes, that's an interesting story. No, I can't help you if you get arrested tonight. <laughs> but in all seriousness, for many of us, this would not have been possible without the love, care, and support of our friends, family, and loved ones. Let us take a moment to thank them for always being there for us. Also, we cannot forget the faculty and staff for not only their knowledge and guidance, but for pushing us, for only accepting our best. Let us thank the faculty for taking the time to be a mentor along the way. Today, we're here to celebrate your achievement and also celebrate and honor the lives of those that we lost along the way. I ask that we take a moment of silence for them as well. Thank you. It's interesting to note, our commitment to our values today and each other has forged the strength of our work ethic, pushing us to greater heights. It reminds me of a phrase that my father's always told me. He said, son, when it comes time to move the piano, never reach for the bench. And that's what you've done. That's what standing here today means. You didn't reach for the bench, you did the heavy lifting. That's a testament to your intellect, your character, your heart. You have so much more to give. You are bold, passionate, and ambitious. Success is measured by the obstacles that one has overcome. Make no mistake, you got here today because you got up more times than you've been knocked down. But remember, my friends, there are only 24 hours in a billable day. But if you do find a way around that, please let me know. I would like to i like to use that. I ask that you keep moving with the same intensity, passion, and purpose that you came in here with. Learn from your mistakes. And when it comes to choices, do the right thing, even though it's probably going to be the hardest. You have to, because people are going to look at you differently. You have the remarkable opportunity to help and inspire. It's one of the hallmarks of our noble profession, the gravity of which will carry on far past the boundaries of today. By standing here today, we recognize, whether it's truly hit you or not, that you've mastered the great pillars of our fine institution, those of knowledge, skills, and ethics. Knowledge, the building blocks of information needed to solve the problems of the day. Skills, the application from externships to clinical experiences. And ethics, a style, no, a lifestyle a commitment to being honest and compassionate to those around you. These are the pillars that you've mastered. To making it here today, we made it. I mean, it sounds good, say it with me, we made it. it. Sounds good, from highlighting every page of your first reading assignment to that first time being called on in class to stand and deliver, we made it. Say it with me, we made it. <laughs> from law journals, trial skills, and student organizations who helped others in between, we made it to briefing all of those assigned cases your final year, 
<laughs> to putting those final words on your last exam, we made it. To coming up on stage, shaking the dean's hand, and becoming a proud owner of a Juris Doctorate, you made it. And so, my fellow graduates, we keep moving for love and honor. Thank you.